What's up, guys? It's Walrus here with my friend Terminator Fresh Six Six Six. All right, and we're gonna be talking about uh, failures and successes using pickup lines. Um, so what's the funniest one you've used that actually has worked? Um, probably. Do you have a map? I'm getting lost in your eyes. That's worked like a couple of times, but. Not all the time. <laughs> I've had some bad experiences with that. Yes, tell me about those experiences. <laughs> well, one time I said that to a girl and she slapped me across the face. Yeah, uh, the, the most successful one I've had was, uh, you're so beautiful you've made me forget my pickup line. Yeah, I've used that multiple times um, and it's always worked. I don't know what it is. It just somehow works. Um, by the way, you guys should be taking notes because these are actually <laughs> really fun. Um... Yeah, so, have you ever, ha Comment in the, dis in the video what, vi what pickup lines have worked for you. Yeah, comment on what, which ones have worked for you and which ones haven't. Um, so, there's, I know people say they use, um, um, a lot of the times they're mainly for jokes, but I want ones that you've actually tried using as a joke, possibly. But ones that are actually funny, um, that worked for you, so maybe you can help other people out. Um, so. Yeah, definitely. So, some of them just work all the time. Some of them, people don't fall for it. They get slapped in the face. Anyway, so, you've been playing, uh, a lot of Black Ops. So what, do you like Modern Warfare 2 or Black Ops better? Well, it, it's all, it has to be narrowed down to different categories. Because there's different things I like about each one. For example, Modern Warfare 2, I like the graphics better. But that's just opinion if you like sharp graphics or not so sharp graphics. And with Black Ops, I like how the guns are less... How the guns aren't overpowered like they were in Modern Warfare 2. And you see, I'm like completely different. Um, the graphics to me don't really matter. I'd rather have guns that look more modern though. So I agree that I like the the picture in the game Modern Warfare 2 a lot better. Um, I don't really enjoy how Black Ops kind of seems like so old. The guns don't even have like a lot of detail to them. Right. Um, the scar has detail. The tar, the intervention, they all have really good detail. And in Black Ops, you don't have a as much of a selection of guns. I mean, well. you have a huge selection, but... They're not good guns. The yeah, exactly. <laughs> the majority of guns that are underused, like the Uzi, I, I can't use it. Like, maybe, okay, yeah, maybe I can get, like, I can go positive with it, probably get a KD of 2 with it, but still, that's not great. I mean, if you go into a search and destroy, half the people are using AK-74Us, FAMASs, Galils... You can't really match them. I mean, the guns in Modern Warfare 2, at least you could, like, you could use Scar. Um, you could match up a F2000. I know. I've seen people use that with Thermal and get, like, games of 12 and 3 in Search and Destroy easily. Um, it's all about how you use them in that in Modern Warfare 2. Um, I mean, if, you, if you're good with the Uzi in Black Ops, I guess you could do decent. Um... I'm not saying everybody's bad with it. It's just the majority of people are horrible with that gun. Yeah, it's a lot different than it was in Modern Warfare 2. Yeah, Modern Warfare 2, you could actually use all the guns rather than just, you know, um, rather than just, like, I don't even know. Just rather than having to learn how to use the gun, you just have to have, like, in Black Ops, rarely ever. Basically, maybe one out of ten times if you have a decent shot you'll pull off a triple spray when they're all running at you. I mean, in Modern Warfare 2, if you had a decent gun, you could pull that off almost every time. Um, but Modern Warfare 2 is kind of unbalanced. I mean, what they did is they made stopping power in the same tier of many other perks that were horrible, like Danger Close and Hardline. I mean, nobody needs Hardline. Right. Danger Close... You really only use when you use one man army noob tubes. So there's really nothing in cold blood. Yeah, people use it, but like did once one class to blow stuff out of the air when you're like not doing anything. Right. 
So if you're if you're a big if you're someone who hates air support or well, everybody hates air support, then me air support. But if you're someone who just takes it down every five seconds, then you definitely want to use cold blooded or in Black Ops Ghost Pro. Yeah, see, in in Black Ops, the only other thing that I would think about using other than um, Ghost is Flak Jacket or even Scavenger. I mean, I'm trying, starting to venture away from Ghost because I kind of find, like, it's kind of pointless. I mean, nobody uses spy planes, and then when the majority of people do, I'm just going to start using Jammers instead. The only game modes that people don't use Ghost is Free For All and Team, Ta team Deathmatch. Yeah, and have you ever had, did you ever find a problem that there's not enough ammo in all your guns in Black Ops? Well, I don't, I don't think that there's not enough ammo, but for example, the Enfield, it took, Enfield took at least 18 shots to kill someone on a, on a regular basis. Like, maybe you can pull off a 10 bullet kill, but in Modern Warfare 2, you could literally take three shots with a UMP or a SCAR and kill someone. You wouldn't have to reload as much first off, um, and things like that. I mean, Modern Warfare 2, in real life, you'll get killed a lot faster than this game. Modern Warfare 2 in no way is realistic other than the way that you die um, by getting shot in the head. Right, and these hit in Modern Warfare 2, I feel like the hit detection was much better. In Black Ops, I, I really hate the hit detection. Black Ops, it's literally impossible to get headshots on command. Modern Warfare 2, you could literally wait a little bit, aim down your sight, get a decent shot, and shoot somebody in the face. That's not the way it is in Black Ops, and that was the best grenade I've ever thrown, by the way. <laughs> um, I just feel like they don't have really enough... I don't know, they don't have enough diversity in these games. I mean, yeah, you usually talk about race when you use that word, but, like, honestly... The majority of guns you find on the ground are from Mosses. You you rarely ever see M14s or M14s or whatever you call them. Or you barely ever see PM63s or Spectres. Or right. you, you you mainly only see specific guns like the AK-74U. Um, but we're leaving now. We are going. So signing out, Awkward Walrus and Terminator Fresh. See you later.